girl Sakaja. Welcome back. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hello. This channel is all about me, fun, randomness, and craziness. If you're returning, thank y'all so much. We're on a slow ass motherfucking journey to 100,000 subscribers, but we gonna get there. So all 12.1 thousand of y'all that are still tapped in, thank y'all, okay? I just wanted to make this really quick, short video. It's part of my Turning 30 series about some predictions that I have about turning 30 years old, okay? And if you're over the age of 30, please let me know like if I'm just reaching for the stars or if I'm on the wrong wavelength, but I didn't do this for when I turned 20 and what I expected my 20s to be, so I kinda wanna have this video as proof for when I turn 40, because you know everything on the internet lives forever. I want this video as proof so I can go back and be like, oh, okay, okay, I, I did that. I accomplished that, okay? So let's get into just a few predictions and a few expectations that I have for myself for the age of 30. Well, 30 to 40, but let's just say the year of 30. I expect to have a baby this year or get pregnant and have the baby when I'm 31, but yo girl, like, it's just time. Whether I'm ready or not, like, you're never really ready for an offspring that looks just like you. Look at this face. Imagine the baby's eye. <laughs> Mimi, that could catch me. But it's time, like, I've had fertility issues in the past and I'm ready, like, I want my little seed. Yes, that shit's gonna be hard. Yes, that shit's gonna take away from my hot girlness. Actually, not really, because a kid ain't slowing nothing motherfucking down, okay? It'll just get a little harder, but a kid ain't slowing nothing down. I expect or anticipate getting pregnant or having a baby this year. I also anticipate making money, okay? If I wanna have a baby, I have to have several sources of income. My main source of income is my normal desk job right now, and I do expect to get a raise this year, a substantial raise I've been advocating for myself. But I still wanna do something on the side. Um, I really want to greatly monetize my content, and I think this is the year that I'm going to invest in like a brand strategist because I know I can make money on social media. I am just not going about it the right way. And I've been holding on to faith that someone would like see potential in me and reach out, but it, it ain't happening yet. It's been three years. I need to go out and do the damn thing by myself. I should be much further along. So I anticipate and I expect 30 to bring me lots of money. I also expect 30 to bring me love. Oh my God, relationship. Can't have a baby. Well, you can. But Takaja is not gonna have no baby and no stable without a stable relationship. That's just not me. Like, I can barely take care of myself by myself. So I'm definitely not doing that with a baby. So I really want my love life to just be at its fullest and I wanna be in love and I wanna feel loved and I want to float in that. So <laughs> Keep your eyes open for that one, baby. I really wanna take up advocacy again, but in a structured way. I'm very passionate about a lot of things, whether it's kids and um, child welfare. I'm very passionate about the world, the ocean, space, I'm astrology. I'm passionate about so many things and I want to pick something and just stick with that advocacy effort and see it all the way through from 30 to 31. I really want to, tailor my energy towards one thing and see it all the way through, whether it's a project, whether it's volunteering or anything like that. I also think at the by the end of 30, I'm gonna be moving to the East Coast. Like, LA has been great, I love LA. I was dying to come back when I lived in DC, but I've been here for two, going on three years and I haven't accomplished what I said I wanted to do. And I think I needed to be out here just to have fun. I haven't done that since college because I took my career so seriously. But I think it's time to be back around the energy of the East Coast where everyone's hustling. Yeah, content creating is great and you can do that anywhere, but there's just a different feel for people grinding on the East Coast. I also anticipate saving money for a down payment for a house, y'all. I really want to be stable. If I'm gonna have a baby, I wanna have, be, have stability. And part of that is owning a house and building wealth, okay? 
Even though I'm just 30, I need to be 30 with some coins in my pocket. I need to, I need to make money. This year is about money for me. And this year hasn't really started for me because it just started off real slow. I had COVID y'all. Y'all ain't seen me. That's why I got these super dark circles under my eyes. But I really need to like tighten up. So after I get back from my birthday trip on February 4th, 5th, like it's time to hit the ground running. Like bartending something, getting a second job and just hustling my ass off. There's no reason, there's money out there. Go get it girl. And the last thing I anticipate and or expect for 30 is just joy. And it, joy, I was feeling so many holes with things such as material things, uh, always feeling like I need to go on a trip or escape, alcohol, all these things. But I have been spending so much time alone, whether I wanted to or not, and I have found so much joy within 